Today I'm fishing the early spawn, late pre-spawn. I'm fishing super shallow and super shallow flats today. So I'm throwing the Hedden Boyo, which is a very subtle bait. It's the exact same looking bait as the Super Spook Junior, only a little bit smaller. I'm gonna show you how and why and where to fish this thing. There he is. This little Boyo is insanely subtle and fishing these shallow, shallow flats in the springtime it's a really great bait because it doesn't make a lot of commotion. It's super subtle going across the top, so you're not, less, you're not likely to spook fish. Rather, you're more likely to catch them. Whenever I encounter these really, really super shallow flats, I always go to the boyo first just because of its subtlety. There he is. That's a good one. Oh, that's not, yeah, okay. So the whole, the whole key is I'm experimenting with the cadence on this. We are literally fishing just a couple feet deep. And so I want to keep it moving, but I want it to be very soft. So I'm not smashing it down. I'm not going bang, bang, bang. I'm just kind of swimming it nice and easy. So I don't, it just draws the attention of the bass. That was a quick release. <laughs> it draws the attention of the bass instead of making all the commotion because we're really, we're fishing super shallow. I mean, I'm throwing it up in water that deep. That's the beauty part about this Boyo. It's small, it's the same width, same thickness as a Super Spook Junior, but it's like half the size. There he is. So you guys remember when you're fishing in the late pre-spawn or early spawn, Get the head and boyo, get on the shallowest flats you can find and throw that head and boyo. And remember, you creek and bank anglers, this bait is a phenomenal bait for pond fishing as well. Early pre-spawn, beginning spawn, you can't beat it. If you like what you saw, hit the like button, make a comment and subscribe so you don't miss a video.